In the last 19 seasons, no one has destroyed our stage and blamed it on science more than our next guest. Please welcome back our science guy, Steve Spangler. On your marks, get set, go. Bam, bam, nice. See, he could be really... <laughs> concentrate, concentrate. You can see a magic incantation if you want. Oh my God. Here's the other thing I like is uh, when I'm trying to find a science demonstration, I try to see the origin. And I was wondering who, uh, who presented science experiments like for entertainment purposes? The Egyptians did. And so they didn't use this same material, but I'll show you what they did. They would take colored sand. So here you go. Take a look at this colored sand, uh -huh. right? And then they would put colored sand in water uh -huh. and then magically be able to reach into the water and pull out dry sand. Because the Egyptians coated the water with beeswax. Here, try that. You can go into here. Just pour it in. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Oh, yeah, the whole bowl is good. Well, All right, so that's a great idea. That's right. No, never done that before. And then, and then look at this. So, yeah, usually as a teacher, I'm, I'm sparing. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, uh -huh. so now watch, see, look at this. It's wow. hydrophobic. So they cover it with something like Scotchgard. So if you want to make your own at home, you can take sand and then cover it with uh, this hydrophobic material, hydrophobic water fearing. And look at this. As you pull it back up again, you get dry That's sand. That's incredible. Isn't that just amazing? Yeah. Very, very cool. So here, here's this for you. I'm not uh, done. For your hand. OK, I'm sorry. <laughs> We'll continue to play. Okay, okay right. now here you yeah. go. This is okay. So I was thinking, well, what else could you cover? That would be just kind of fun. So what if somebody on your staff was going to go to a fancy restaurant and they didn't want to get, like, messy? Uh -huh. So the person's waiting for you right oh, now. Oh, boy. I know. Um, <laughs> is that funny? <laughs> I love it. Oh, no. I've always wanted to do this. So, oh. so watch. So Andy, Andy. Here, here is this for you. <laughs> so that's good. Perfect. Okay. All right. Good? Yeah. OK, so now watch. So the cannons that are here, I've always wanted to put my slime in the cannons. So I made a batch of slime in each of those. And you have the button here. So we coated his entire wardrobe with that special material. So let's just see if it works. So messy Andy is going right. to have a fancy dinner and watch what happens. Oh, Ready? Andy. So, I I love you so much. Stop. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just do it. Go. Well, you said not to do just it. Just do it. You want me to do go. it now? Go, please. When? <laughs> oh. See, look at this. It's just the coat is beautiful. Yeah. It's, you can spill on your pants. That's why I hit him again. OK. All right, here we All right. go. Oh, oh my oh. god. Okay. Oopsie. <laughs> try, try it again. Ah. But here, I was looking at this. Uh, just in case the cannons didn't fire, I got buckets of it. Watch this. What oh, yeah. are you doing? Is that fun? So here you go. Watch this. <laughs> Look at this. See? He could be really. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Okay. Are you OK? OK. It's a little slippery. Okay. It's really slippery. It's OK. Are you OK? I'm good. Ellen, I'm sorry. Sorry, Andy. I'm never coming back to the show, I know. Wait. This look is my at, last look time. At where, wait, look at where his glasses are. His glasses have completely wow. come off. Okay. Go to commercial. Go to commercial? Yes. OK. I have a feeling, because they never tell me what's going to happen, this, this is going to be a big one. This is your last time on the show, right? <laughs> well, I guess so. Uh, so yeah. This is, uh, I went through over 100 demonstrations over the, all the time that we've been on the show together. And so I picked these because each one has something a little bit special. OK. OK, got yep. it? Yep, okay. yep. I know you love magic. Yep, Ready? This I is do. as close to real magic as I can get okay. on your safety glasses. Because okay. nothing says magic like putting on your safety glasses. All righty. All right, here's what I want you to do. Pick up the, uh, the, the beaker of clear liquid and the other beaker right here like this. Uh -huh. All right. So you present to the audience, and now we pour the water into the other beaker. Ready, what? set, yep. and pour it in. All at once, good job. And now just kind of stare at it, concentrate, concentrate. You can say a magic incantation if you want. <gasps> oh my. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa. I know. What I don't was even in know. There? I don't know. Uh, no. The molecules took a little time to connect. And once they connect, it's like a big party. They kind of hook up, and then it changes color. So it's called a clock. Well, that's a bad way of saying that, I guess. Uh, <laughs> Sorry, kids. But then it, it changes color, so it's called a clock reaction. Wow. But watch this. This is what's beautiful. Pour it back in with me. Ready? No, pour it in this big oh, one. Okay. Ready? Set, go. Look at that. And bam. Wow. Ta-da. There it is. Wow. Um, 
So I told you that the Ollie's had something special, and so now, without getting sentimental, this one's special to me. So when you had me on the show the very first time in 2007, at the very, <laughs> I'm getting all, uh, at the very end, we did a version of this, and you looked over at Andy and you gave him the nod and Andy came to me and said, would you like to come back? And it started a 15 year relationship. And um, so wherever I go, um, teach, uh, when I speak at events and things like that, teachers, I uh, do the thing with the red trash can. And so you've allowed me, you changed my life. You've allowed me to take these kinds of things all over the world. And because you like it, teachers like it. And because teachers like it, parents like it. And I think you probably did more for science education than anybody I could ever imagine. Oh, I'm so glad. Oh. I'm so glad. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. So here we go. I'll show you how to make this. You can do this at home because it's always fun. So first of all, you get a trash can. You put a hole in it. So that's why you use your neighbor's trash can. So just go to your neighbor. <laughs> And then you do, it's fine. And then on this side, this is a clear shower curtain, and that's courtesy of the Holiday Inn. Okay. So they have really good, clean, that's not gonna get us in trouble, is it? And then, and then what you do is, well, here, can I help you put it on? Uh, okay, yep. so here we go. So put your, your, this arm in like this, and then over your head, uh -huh. good. All right, so there you go. Got it? So you can kind of hold there, and then your hand can tap here. Now, if you tap, there's air inside. Mm -hmm. So aim it towards me, and uh -huh. tap, and you can hit me with the air. Yeah, harder, harder. Ooh, good. Okay, that's good. Mm -hmm. But you can't see it. No. So the cool part would be go get a smoke machine. Uh -huh. So just it's fine. Just go to your friends, whatever. And so get a smoke machine. And so now I'm going to put the smoke in here like this. Oh, it, oh, there we go. Good. So now if you put the smoke in here, when you tap on the bottom, fast moving air will come out and watch what happens. So I think that's probably enough. So right over here, aim and just give it a good hit. Ready? Oh, look at that. Look at those. Is that great? Here, shoot over there, there you go, good, good, yeah. Okay, 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 you're good. So now it's a little game. You and I get to now knock cups off of the audience members' heads. So if you look there, look under your chairs, you might, in this section here, look, you got cup? Look at that, cups up. So uh, I'm gonna fill mine with smoke, I'm gonna fill yours with smoke, and then we're gonna get up there and we're just gonna try to hit and see if we can knock them off the heads. With the smoke? And with the smoke, so the rings are gonna kinda help protect us, there, kinda give us an idea of where to aim. So that's a pretty good one for me. This one's gonna be an excellent one for you. And then hopefully we won't be able to see anything after that. Okay, come on up here. You ready? All right, you do that side, I'll do this side. On your marks, get set, go. Bam, bam, nice. You gotta put them back up again, look at you. Put them back up again. Look at I'll just, just, bam, oh, I got a triple shot over there. I know you. Happening now. <laughs> well, uh, there has been some demonstrations over the 15 years that we developed just for this show, and they took off. And so now you see them on other shows. But they started here, and I figured, well, why not take one to the next level, right? Because you said anything worth doing is worth overdoing. And so. Did I say that? Well, I thought you did in a dream, uh, but <laughs> at least that's what I told the insurance agent. Okay. <laughs> so uh, we happen to have a little surprise for you backstage. Okay. Fair enough? Mm. Take a look at this. All righty. No, oh, oh, oh. oh my God! Holy moly! Well, if you take a look here, Ellie is right here. There's Twitch. Uh, the rest of the front row. There, this is my family. So thank you for inviting okay. Jack Hi. and Mark and Scott and Hi. my wife Renee Hi. back here. Hi. Your family back there, Brian Higgins yep. back there. Yep. So they're dumping right now liquid nitrogen into these trash cans. Uh -huh. Okay. Yep. So liquid nitrogen, you know, from over the years, like 320 degrees below zero. We've done so many things. We've cooked with it. We've done everything, but it's not good really for hot water. So that's why we put hot water in those buckets. Okay? So, and don't worry that they're dressed like that. It's fine, okay? So, <laughs> it's just to be protected. Right? So, in just a second, they're gonna pick up the water, and then as the audience, we're gonna go three, two, one. Oh, and I, I added a little something special to the water. Whatever. So, uh, they're going to, they're, they're, they're gonna pick up the buckets, and then we'll go three, two, one, and then they're gonna dump them in. And the reason we're standing here is because it's maybe the messiest thing I've ever done. All righty. Okay. <laughs> All right, guys, ready? Buckets up. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. They're kind of heavy because they're and they've got hot water in them. So yeah, I just want to make sure they're all in position. Oh, wow. Jack, you feeling good? They're Everybody heavy. feeling okay. good? Everybody all the way around? Yeah. All right, the audience, help count me in. We'll do it from three. Here we go. Okay. Three, Don't. two, one, jump! Oh. There we go. Ah!
Oh, right. <laughs> Holy moly. Are you guys still there? It's very cold. <laughs> oh, I see you now. Wait, it's, it's coming Can through. Can anyone see okay, it? I think it's going to clear. All right, well. Everybody fan like follow this Follow Steve on Instagram and TikTok to see more of his favorite science experiments. I want to thank Steve Sangler, Ellie Kemper. I want to thank all of you for watching. Thanks for being a part of my final season.